on game one script. It's gonna be a good one. We've come a very long way from the early days and see another addition to the storyline here. Going to PS2 to start off. We're starting off very, very early. Actually gonna get some meter online from countering that. Very early start here though. Looks like a lot of menu, a lot of buffing coming up here for Salem. Already fully wigged Ooh. out using Psych Up early to get on that hit, but uh, still accelerate and bounce. Yep, we'll see what he's going for here too. Another Psych Up. He's using, I love the speed buff that he's using to go and run to the other side and get additional buffs, like just using everything he has. He's happy to not approach here and just pull up the menu and kind of pick whatever he wants. Dealer's choice. And a very passive Leo we're seeing here too, not opting for many of the very aggressive times. It's the first time we've seen a really pressuring shield there, something that could have been punished. Because that down air hovering above. Okay. Still Go staying, staying slow here, staying slow. No reason to rush in. Both these guys obviously are in losers, so they don't want to have one misstep could equal, you know, the, the grand finale of your, your bracket here at Frostbite. And this is insane. This is before top 24, if I'm not mistaken. Are we in top 24 now? Oh, no, we are not in top 24 right now. We have a few wow. matches prior to this, and one of these players will not be making it to even top 24. It's tough to even think about, too, but that is the world we are living in. Yep, so with the Arsene nerfs recently script, we see the counterplay of just waiting it out or getting hits, hold on. And running out the meter, running out the clock is so good against him now, but Leo capitalizing there, getting a throw into an up air, very good stuff from Leo. Now Salem can't really do these runaway. What? Oh my what? goodness, Salem. Salem? <laughs> okay, I was like, he should get the crit, the cherry on top. Oh my god, he just popped that shield like a bubble. Big up air juggles here going, trying to get a reset on up B2, not gonna find it. Still spacing out. Holding down center stage. Salem's happy to take this all day. Even if the bullets do connect, they don't do a lot of damage. So he's happy to sit back there. Now he has bounce too. There's literally, Leo's gonna have to approach. Sit there, yep. Oh my God, caught this him full sleeping. Full send right oh! here, this is full send. Was that a confirm into 61%? Oh my God. From full send to our send here. Leo oh! is absolutely <laughs> popping off with a very, very slick bread and butter off of the throw, getting a huge spike. You know, the dunk contest happened last weekend in Chicago, but we're seeing one again here in Detroit. MK Leo putting on a show with the Arsene Joker. You don't see it as much anymore due to the nerfs, but oh my God, it is still so... <laughs> it's just, it's quiet down, quiet <laughs> I down. Gotta, I just shut up and watch that go. You yeah. never know, man. You never know what Salem's cooking up there on the other side of the stage. You always see Salem run to this corner too, but as soon as Leo wants to approach in the corner, it seems like Salem has an answer with menu. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the menu's such a great bait too. You can get, get people to, oh my wow. God, he just, it, it, that's like the slowest hustle I've ever seen, but Salem made it work out for him. Great catch there. But what great conditioning though, because MK Leo had been doing a runaway side beat all so, so much, but running right under it and Salem able to find a stop because of it. Yeah, Salem, I mean, he's playing so well right now. Already has the lead on Leo, but here comes Arsene. This could be the swing moment of the match script. Let's see what happens. Okay. Oh, we haven't really seen the neutral be a whole lot either. No. Not really much mana, no mana worries coming to the side of Salem too. Very, very good management. Mana management, but here we go. Pressuring at ledge. Ooh, so scary. Ooh. Oh, that was a bait because he had been getting caught by those quick projectiles, but that time it's going to reflect it with our send, and now we're seeing the bounce and uh -oh. the buff. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy, uh, his movement with the with the buffed up uh, hero has gotten so much better too over time. It was always good, but this is incredible. I mean, it's just crazy how much air and ground speed you gain when you get the accelerate. You're able to find so many more hits that you wouldn't have normally been able to find. Stuck in this ledge here now too. They're trying to find a forward tilt, but catching the landing with the air. <gasps> I wonder, like, <laughs> can, can it activate on the on the counter? I don't know. Oh, I don't think MK Leo wants to find out and gamble that one. Oh, he's doing it again! He's shooting out the ghastly. Such a crazy, crazy raise they're playing in too, but Leo looks like he's trying to approach a lot more here. For the buffs here. I like it. Up. This is terrifying. There's one media aerial or a dash attack or something. Oh, but, but the power behind Psych Up, if it gets Rebels guarded, that'll easily be our send. But Leo's so close, he probably won't gamble it at that point. But here we go. Leo's turn to talk. What are you going to say, Leo? Back air, weaving around the aerials. See what you got here though, Sam coming up from ledge, using the jump to retreat into platform. That's why I love PS2, especially when you ledge trapped. Buff, yep, yep, that is gonna do it. The old F tilt, well done by Salem, taking down a huge game one against MK Leo. Wow, into it, I, I feel like the momentum really, really shifted once we saw that shield break. Oh, I just got word from the field, thank you so much. Apparently, you can, if you use whack and you rebels guard it, apparently it can just kill you. That's Shout good. out. That is good to know, shout out to Kuma. Send me a message from New England. I appreciate that, man. Good knowledge right there, but man, oh man, if there is one storyline going into this event script, you gotta talk about the three characters that received pretty big nerfs in the mm -hmm. last patch. 
Joker, Zero Suit, Palutena, all of them. So obviously you got to think of the, the people who are assigned to those characters, Mars, uh, Leo, and Nairo, and see how they do today. And it's been rough for two of them, but Leo trying to stay alive in this loser's bracket. He's got to fight against Salem. Uh, he's gonna go to he's gonna go to Yoshi's. Mm -hmm. And as you're saying, the two, uh, the one other person in losers is Mars, and then Nairo's still on the winner side of bracket here. So we'll three how those, see how the three representatives of those nerfed characters will be doing for the rest of this bracket. Leo looking the worst off of all of them right now. Going to Yoshi's story for his counterpick. I think obviously the tri are nice. You don't want to give your opponent a lot of horizontal room to run away. You saw Salem take a lot of advantage in being in the corner and getting buffed up. Yeah. Looks like Leo wants to take the advantage to him. Yeah, usually getting cornered, a bad thing for your character, especially against someone like MKLeo who can push the advantage so well, but Salem was, oh, he thought about it. He hovered over the over the HP, the old Hocus Pocus. He decided not to, though. He's, he's up a game. There's no reason to do that. Oh, he's going to zoom? I like the attempt yeah. by, uh, by Leo. Truly random, though, so there's no way to really anticipate that one. Boom, coming back up. Not going to get hit by any of the bullets on Rising, too. Actually, you saw the spot dodge to avoid the falling up air. That was crazy. Gonna zoom in again, getting it a lot there. If you're close to the blast zone, you have higher percent chances of getting that zoom to help you recover. So good job by Salem using that the best he can. But now Arsene is gonna show up and Salem's stock is certainly ready to pop and there it goes. And you know it, brother. MK Leo patrolling the middle of the stage. It looks like Salem wants to push the aggression while you have the invincibility too. There's kind of two schools of thought as the counter comes in. Do you want to wait on the platform, wait out Arsene, or take your invincibility and have the problem in Ooh. their court? Did you see the movement off that platform too? I mean, you're talking about MK Leo's movement. He's got Arsene and Joker ready to rock. Nair too, he's been using a lot of Nairs. I feel like it's just a good hitbox against Hero. Kind of in that space, he has a hard time covering like diagonally above him, or can at least without a long starting up, uh, up tilt or something like that. I don't know if you saw that, but the Rebels Guard was actually used on the bang right there uh -huh. too. Able to get a lot of meter online. Actually, Arsene coming all the way out. This is a, uh, this is a bounce, bounced up Hero. Uh oh, wait, inside, wait. Inside. I think, the, I think the, the, the bullets go through it, I think, because they're physical. Mm -hmm. That's what it looks like. It I'm pretty sure case. it goes through the bounce. The okay. Well, it's weird because we didn't see it the first game. I feel like Leo kind of stopped shooting. I, maybe he didn't know, or I don't know. Which, it's crazy to catch Leo losing like that, so who knows? But either way, we're moving on. We're trying to get an Uppy out of the uh, just the scramble situation out of Uppy with Hero. Super good because you can get everyone in the air and you can kind of control situations in there. Oh, okay, good counter, but how did Salem avoid that hitbox? That was insane. I thought Leo was gonna spike him right there, but uh -huh. Salem with the rising up air from the, to recover, that's insane. Mm -hmm. Trump back air, nice job going over the ledge too, covering a couple different options there. Good patience from Leo. Mm -hmm. Accelerate on Hero here, gonna be jumping around, using these platforms extremely well in that air mobility. Wow, just so fast. And Kayla's just full on sprint chasing after this guy, not able to find a single hit. Yeah, so I think I think the bounce is more for the side beat, you know what I mean? Which Leo right, has right. been using to a lot to kind of set the tempo there. But here comes Salem off stage. Nice job by Leo going high above that, that tornado. So many heroes want to use that as an edge guarding tool, especially when you're both off stage like that. Well, held many up there. It's looking to threaten MK Leo with it. Leo not phased. Frizz. Mm -hmm. A little bit of a projectile warfare, but now that's going to get that's shut down right now completely. Ooh, you saw the cross-up Leo was going for too, but Salem, again, up -beat out of the scramble situation, can cover both sides. Yeah, heroes can actually get follow-ups off the up on platforms. So if you up hit them, turn around, you can get something pretty quick. So I think that's what Salem's looking for. But Leo doing a great job playing patiently, so close to Arsene. Oh my god, never mind. Quick zap, get him on out of there too. Back to even stock. Salem looking to climb the small mountain that Leo has put in front of him. Ooh, Leo going high though. Salem jumping in the situation. That second up air would have definitely been curtains. Yeah, the goal right now for Salem is to not get hit, as it is always. But the thing is, the more he gets hit now, the harder Arsene will be to fight when he does come out. It really looks like Salem's going for like a falling up air here, right here to follow some like a huge, huge follow up too. I gotta be, gotta be cognizant of that as Leo and he catches another high recovery here from Salem. Snooze. Okay. Uh, you know what? You he, cle he cleared space either way. I like that option because he didn't find the zoom, but he did find a way to recover anyway. The menu. Hold on, this is real big trouble. Ooh, I don't know. That was a pretty. Crazy Crazy option from Leo, but here's the thing: what if we see a crit script? I'm not trying to curse it into the world, but uh oh, you might have just spoken something into existence here. Arsene is going to look to be some sort of savior to Joker here, and MK Leo stuck in the corner Looking for a couple down tilts there. Salem with the pressure, mm -hmm. Leo fighting out though. It's just so nice to have Woo. have Leo in the corner and have Arsene in the corner like that. Hey! Too. Just wasting time. He still had the oh, nice job using the active hitbox of the charged up beat. Oh, going Looking so deep though with Salem. So oh. Close. Both players, the fair. Boom, that is going to do it. Yep. Well played. 
Man, by both of them. That really came down to pretty much last hit. And Arsene was very close to running out. So good job by Leo hitting his win condition there and taking down a clean game too. Mm -hmm. Now, how do I think Salem might counteract this? I think stage is gonna be really important. You were talking about the platform follow-ups you have with your uppy out of block as hero. I think we could see something like maybe if Smashville is not banned, we could see we saw Triplats come out to play last time. That was yep. not too bad for Salem too, but I think MK Leo was using the platforms extremely well. So Interested to see what we pick here. Got that me. was a huge game, too, for Leo because he had lost that one being down. Oh, he's going to run it back, it looks like. That's a universal sign for run it back. You know, you give him the old, give him the old loop to do. <laughs> I'm saying, you know, you know, everyone knows what we're talking about. We don't even have to show up. We know, we know. Uh, I, I think the hero, I think the hero is playing great right now. Yes. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Lock that bad boy in. Don't think about it twice. <laughs> What's going on with Riddles and Tweak right now? <laughs> you can see them in the background. <laughs> Just saying hey to each other. <laughs> here we go. Game three, running it back. And oh! Rebels go getting our set online here, too. Already showing his ugly head. Looks like Salem still trying to hold advantage, Damn, really, even though. He really went after our sense looks right there. <laughs> you know, either way. Our <laughs> set is gone. So this is a horrible position now because he's at 77 with no Arsene. He got it at 13, which is great, but he couldn't get anything out of it. Now he might not get an effective Arsene this whole stock. Ooh, ooh, just the spot dodge plays. Insane right there, too. Both of them avoiding attacks. Looks like Leo gonna be an advantage, though. Okay, nice fall through the platform, too. Good spacing there from Leo, or from Salem, getting the hit on Leo. Down to the lead in something here. Great tech chase on the platform, too. Even catching while under the platform. Woohoo! MK Leo, are you serious? <laughs> My goodness, but again, the super aggressive returning with the side beat. How the hell Salem. did he know? How did he know? It doesn't matter. Salem takes the first stock. What do we have here, though, from MKLeo? Again, uh, everyone's coming immediately off these platforms. They want smoke. No invincibility I need. Gonna get grabbed here, though, on the platform. Go for a deep forwarder. No, looks like Salem's just gonna wait. That was that uppy we were talking about, too. It does so well in those scramble situations, especially off stage. Yeah, off stage trying to catch Leo tethering back. It's, a, it's pretty active at the ledge there, so good job by Salem, keeping the pressure on. I think the goal here for Salem should be to activate Arsene, run away and run it out. Oh, okay, never mind, go, yep, go, go nuclear. Yep, get the uh, get the uh, buff on there and then start swinging. Uh, oh, he doesn't have anything going on right now. No, no. Right back here, catching, trying to go to the other platform on the other side. Salem, gonna get back, low mana here. Yeah, only 18. Yep, Leo will take that. I heard actually Arsene forward tilt is either, it's plus on shield is what I heard. It's why they use it so much. No, true, like yeah, truly. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's plus on shield, the Arsene uh, F tilt. So. I only laugh because it's terrifying. <laughs> As we see Leo find a back here and even it up in stocks. Not too bad at all considering how we saw this game start. Salem had a very dominant lead. And it honestly looks like this is a mirror of what happened last stock. Yeah. Almost. Yep. Hold on. I, I love how he throws those out, dude. Like, like he wants so bad to say that I use whack and it killed MK Leo instantly. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, he wants it so bad. Here we go. Both players feeling each other out. Salem's okay standing in the corner. Leo he, playing that range game again, though. We saw that game one is kind of coming in and coming out, too. He's flowing very well between the play states. Yeah, the thing is, Salem's looking for a couple different options. If he sees a good projectile, a bang, or a kaboom, or any of those, he's going to try to throw it at Leo. If not, a buff is good. And if not any of those, cancel out of the menu. And isn't that insane? That's kind of how you have to play Hero, too, on the fly, always adapting to what you have open. Dude, he's an RPG character. You go turn by turn. You wait. You take your turn, and then you go, and then when it's your opponent's turn, it's your turn. But now we see, obviously, the Salem's turn. He's going to get the fully charged one. Good damage. Rinse and repeat. I let you to Leo going low against Salem. Not going to be in a position to punish, but still on the get up. Ooh. Ping him. Really? Really? <laughs> Went for the snooze. Okay. Try to put him to sleep. Come on back here, here too. Oh, the jump from ledge. You're going to catch Salem. The air dodge oh, going no. to be red. But we're live! For now, at least, Leo keeping pressure on here. More back airs. Dude, he didn't even go for a zoom there. I'm surprised. I feel like that's a perfect situation to get. If you get a zoom, that's exactly what you want to do with here. Oh, he snagged him out of that? Leo, man, just playing incredibly, but. Salem saying it doesn't matter, coming down to a, a last stock situation in the all-important game three script. My goodness, they've all been last stock situations every single game. Wondering who's gonna take it here, obviously. Ooh, spicy little tomahawk into an up tilt. Salem's really taking off with this lead, but Arsene is out. This is where Leo makes his comeback, this is where he wakes, makes his money, but who knows how big the, the nerf has been to this character. It's hard to say so far, script. Right. Very first time we've really seen it. 
Ooh, push to the limit. Here's MK Leo. We're going to find another bread and butter in the corner. These throws have just gotten Leo out of so many sticky situations. It's so funny because you think about Leo and you think about how clutch he's always been with Arsene. And now we're seeing, like, basically the dev team was like, how can we crank that to 900? Leo has to play clutch every time he gets Arsene now because he's probably not getting two for stock or the ones that he gets. They run out so... A Excuse new me. pick Excuse here. Me. Well, Leo is up and Salem is staring at his tournament life. What does he go to? He goes to Samus, the bounty hunter. I'm interested to see this one, man. Uh, I think we're going to see more or less the same plan in neutral. Run, get his charge, and then he's going to run back and do it again. He's trying to camp out MK Leo, but Leo's happy to just sit back too. This will be big damage too. I mean, but this is one of those characters that people always want to say super good, but we never. It's, it's hard to see consistent results too. I yeah. want to see Salem's take on it. Okay, looking for a couple of charge shot mix-ups, but this looks tricky because, Ooh. okay, okay. Touch yeah. a shield, you'll get up B, that's for sure. Also, too, the tri like that, if you are Samus, you can up B straight to that middle platform, too, and you have a very, very low landing lag. Mm -hmm. Fighting it out with the Zare, looking for some charge shots. Salem happy to sit back and just, you know, you don't need to you don't need to land a lot of damage initially. If you charge the charge shot, that's putting pressure on Leo, but he's not really falling for it right now. Right. Leo trying to get aggressive with that forward air off stage. You're actually going to give Salem stage control, but... The jump from ledge gonna get, again, resetting situations back to back to back. Right. Drag down, getting a grab too. Leo cooking a little bit right now. Oh, he waited out the <laughs> air dodge. It didn't matter though. Woo! Ooh, wow. A little slide, he's getting slick with it. He's like, all right, you wanna camp me on the other side of the stage? That's fine, we can play this game all day. Leo has the lead. He's the one who can just sit back and call the shots basically. He hasn't even gotten Arsene yet and Samus is gonna be at 100 by the time he gets it, yep. But this Ooh. is nice, a huge conversion there, taking the absolute distance. Ooh, the fake tether. I like that. Wow, the air dodge down through the charge shot. Did not hit Leo. That was so close. Matrix it, dude. And then he gets a back air, man. This is not, I don't know, dude. I really like the hero, especially after that first stock. Dude, Yikes. Ooh, coming up again from the top platform. Another upbeat from Salem. Leo hunting, though. Again, this has been the only place we've been seeing consistent damage is upbeat in the middle of the stage and on the top platform. Border from Ledge not going to lead into anything either. It looks like Leo just moving in and out of Samus' zone a little bit too quickly. Up B again. That's where Salem has been getting most of his uh, his damage. It's good positioning and good shield work, and then just recognizing that you can punish your opponent out of shield. Very big. Screw attack is super good out of shield. Okay, <laughs> the, okay. The tether is so nice. Yeah, a smooth movement there from, from Salem, but it looked cool, but... Joker's still living on the first stock. That was a phenomenal back air. That was one of the most creative, uh, aggressive options from Ledge I had seen today. Leo trying to get cute with the gun work in the air, but he's getting punished for it again. Guess what it was? Another screw attack. That's right. <laughs> Maybe see a dash attack kill at this point from Samus. Something like that. Up B. Okay. Ooh, we stale. will. We will. What is what I'm saying, too? That move is so stale. It's still killed. All right. Salem in a decent spot now. I like that charge shot, too. It's like too close for Leo to kind of try to react and uh, Rebels guard. So you don't want to get caught in Rebel's Guard against Samus because you run up and tether grab you right. very easily. Wall jump here. There's another really good thing about this stage. These very long, far down walls give you a little bit more mix-up potential in your recovery. And we see maybe a juggle catching the air dodge here too. It went up air and air. Salem finding a first serious string here too. Trying to continue with the up air, or the up B in the middle of the stage. Not going to find it. These wall jumps getting a little predictable from Salem though. Leo going to catch the uh, the third attempt at a wall jump back here. There with an up smash. Not going to kill though. Ooh, you got the old cool animation. The idle animation. The snipe. Not quite enough yet. Stage okay. Good use of the. Oh, never mind. That is it. Leo in full control of this game. Salem jumping right down off the platform, giving him the Arsene a little more time. Okay. Off, the, off the shield, the charge shot too. Nothing in the tank Ooh. here. Sam got to get back. Vanilla, Ooh, the down tilt, leading into a juggle here. Yeah. Screw attack. <laughs> Pretty good option, I guess. Yeah. Seen it a lot from this character for sure. She forces you in, and then once you get near close enough to striking distance, she can pull the trigger on the up B, so. Ooh, hard hit on the spike there too. No follow up. You saw the back air come out. Didn't find it. Another wall jump here, dude. But he's going to get actually a very defensive get, for, uh, get up from ledge there. Being as high as possible and coming all the way down too, but just may have delayed it. Oh, cannot believe the more the morphs actually stalled for a little bit, but going a little too low on the recovery. Salem will fizzle out in that game four to what to what was an emphatic set. In the